Daru Jones, New York. It's a certain grit, I think, that, um, that comes from being in New York. It's all or nothing. You know what I'm saying? It's like you got to get it in because the next man is waiting to take your gig. <laughs> so and you got to come with it. You know, the drum machine thing did its time, and it's cool, but now a lot of albums and music you hear out, people are adding the live instrumentation back. So that's what the New York scene is about now. New York is a type of city where a lot of times musicians, we're commuting, you know, on the train, subway, cab, you know what I'm saying? And that's just the way of life. So for the most part in New York, carrying your own gear, setting up, it can be tiring before you even start. This is an ideal that I had, you know, just the whole compact type of, type of vibe. You got the cases that come with it. You can carry them shoulder to shoulder, and then you good money. You won't be tired before you start the gig. What I like about them is that they don't sound cheap. They're just not a toy, you know what I'm saying? You're gonna, you're gonna get a nice, full, big sound, and that's, that's the vibe. I'm excited, like I'm able to still keep, you know, the boom bap, you know what I'm saying? And that's what I've been, you know, been known for, like being an aggressive drummer and a dynamic drummer. Playing with dynamics, and it's important that I have the tools to be able to give me that aggression where people know that that's my sound. And it's flossy. You got the gold vibe. It's not even a rap. It's like lacquer, you know what I'm saying? It's so cool, like the, the paint. People, you know, we don't want to take all attention, you know what I'm saying? But people be like, yo, that's a good singer, but that drum set, woo. You might get a couple of gigs from that, you know what I'm saying? Who, know, who knows? But the drum kit can be placed in various settings and you won't feel like you got the wrong gig. You know, you can have this at, the, at your jazz gig and this still pop off. You can have this at your rock and roll gig and this still pop off your hip hop gig and you like the best dressed drummer, you know what I'm saying? And then you can have it at your soul and it still pop off. You can mount the tom, it comes with the, you know, with the mounted clip. And also you can take it off where you don't have to have the mount on it and you just have the plate in there and it's still clean. It's like, I'm a perfectionist. I like for things to look a certain way. I think it's very important. I said it's not a toy, and I feel like I'm, I'm still playing on a mega kit. I feel like I haven't lost anything, and that's, that's really important. This drum set will fit, will fit in your bedroom, you know what I'm saying, in your living room, and you can use it for tracking, you can use it for live, you can use it on the streets, and, and the sounds are still big, still a big sound. Can't beat that, that's, that's, that's next. With this drum kit, you can actually, you know, build and, and find, find your sound. I can tune it hot, you know, tune everything tight. If I want to tune low, I feel like with this kit, I can still get that same, that same grit, you know what I'm saying, that same bottom. And, and like I said, it doesn't take up a lot of space. Yo, I'm bugging because Whoever thought of these, these lightweight stands, kudos, bro, because, yo, hardware is the heaviest thing in life, pretty much. Like, drummers, we, we, we um, dread carrying hardware, you know. The, the, the drums is cool, but when you get to the hardware, you're like, oh, man, the joints is just so heavy. But these boys right here, that's it. Like, feather, lightweight, you don't want to just be lugging heavy gear, you know what I'm saying? Because you got to still play, and so you don't want to wear yourself out. And they can withstand big and small cymbals, which is really important because I don't want to compromise because I have a lighter stand. That means I got to bring little cymbals. I mean, of course, you know, I'm using these today, but I've tried, I've actually tried my regular big 22 inch and they're sustainable, you know what I'm saying? Like I can still, and I'm a very animated player. Like I'm inspired by like Gene Krupa. I love that showmanship, that drumming where it's, you know, it's animated. That's, that's, that's the school I come from, like coming up in church. You can play rock, you can get gritty, you can jump around, and the stands are gonna be there. So big shout to DW for those. D 
DW is always on some next. So they, they, they got us on this one. They got us on this. I'm excited. It's a dream, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm, I'm honored. I was able to build with their team, you know, about creating something, you know, minimal, where you can use, you know what I'm saying, and get to where you're going, not be tired before the gig is, 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 is started and when it's over. Lightweight stands, and you can just store everything in the, in the bag, then you out. Darby Jones, New Yorker. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.